Dude, how ugly was it? It was, it was, it was butt ugly. How about that? <laughs> it was nasty. It was de- a deplorable performance. They were embarrassed, and Reggie Jackson just put it on them. Mm. With Kawhi Leonard and Paul George on the bench as cheerleaders because both were injured. When I saw Russell Westbrook say what he said, listen, he's had a bad season. We all get that. But he's still Russell Westbrook. And a lot of times people have unfairly attacked his character throughout the years because I find him to be somebody who strives to be selfless. He's not somebody that doesn't care. He's never cheated us with effort. But Will Bond, J. Rose, Greedy, I got to tell you, when I watched him in the post-game press conference last night, that was the first time, just regardless of what has happened with Russell Westbrook this season, that I looked at him and said, he does not deserve to be a Laker. Mm. I have never heard any member of the Los Angeles Laker in my quarter century plus of covering the sport say, I had no expectation. First of all, wearing the purple and gold brings expectation. They got 17 titles, okay? Secondly, and most importantly, your teammates are LeBron James and Anthony Davis. They both have chips. You were brought there pretty much by LeBron James to help deliver the chip. And to say that you had no expectations, I know that you were just responding to the the questioner, but the bottom line is the answer that you were disseminating was to the masses, which includes Laker Nation. And when you say you don't have any expectation, that is something I have never heard, Will Will Wilbon, from a Laker.